Alright everyone, I've actually got a new series for us all. I decided, you know, with me getting used to it, I might as well add an extra episode to the mix. Uh, this is one that I wanted to start a little before Hogwarts Legacy came out. But I decided to wait on it to do Hogwarts Legacy initially. Uh, I will still be doing that one. That will come out Monday. This one will be coming out on Sundays. I will say this. I asked Joe and Anoris, Jedi or Sith, and they gave me Jedi. So we will be playing a Jedi Knight campaign with our good hero here, Solnus. Uh, there he is. Look at our pretty boy. But let's get this party started, eh? Welcome to Typhon, Padawan. Everyone at the temple is looking forward to meeting you. Your former masters praise your combat skills. They say you're becoming an expert duelist. Well, that is good. Now, what type of style do I want to go for? I'm sorry. I don't think we've been introduced. Sorry. Darren Weller, watchman of the training grounds. I greet new arrivals, show them around. The Jedi Council will assign you a new master to oversee your final trials. You'll be tested in ways you can't imagine. But when you leave Tython, you'll know what it means to be a Jedi Knight. More importantly, you'll know yourself. Oh, that's adorable. Uh... Oh, well, might as well get started, right? I'm eager to face these trials. Where do I start? There's a speeder here that will take you to... Hang on. Getting an emergency signal. Flesh Raiders? Armed with blasters? He must be mistaken. Why is that? Things? Animals? Flesh Raiders are a species of hostile natives. They're smart enough to use tools and violent beyond reason. I'm sending every able bodied Jedi down to the Padawan training grounds right away. Especially you. Why especially me? What makes me any better than the others? You've been trained for dangers like this. I know I can count on you. Take the speeder outside to the training grounds, push back the flesh raiders, and find out if they're really using advanced weapons. Go. I'll catch up with you after I alert the Jedi Council. May the Force be with you. This really is different than the Sith campaigns. I normally am an imp player. I very rarely play pub. But I do have a question. For those who do watch, uh, let me know. Have you... What's that one? Uh, have you played this game before? If you have, what class is your favorite? If not, and you know about it, what class looks the coolest to you? Uh, for me personally, I see either the Sith Warrior or the... Uh, just playstyle-wise, which is why I'm Jedi Knight or Sith Warrior. <laughs> Or the Imperial Agent for story and just outputting damage. <laughs> That's for sure. But I do want to know what you guys think of both this game, adding another episode a week, and of course anything you think I can do better. We got our buddy here, Master Railnix. I don't want. Come here quickly. The training grounds are not safe today. Really? Nightweller sent me to help with the Flesh Raiders. I'm combat trained and ready to help. And the Force is with us. Few Padawans here can make that claim. The Flesh Raiders moved into the training grounds, organized and ready, attempting to isolate various groups of Padawans. There's a group of students in the hills we lost track of. They're not combat trained. Oh no. Don't worry. Those Padawans will get home safe. I promise. I've got a beacon here. 
If you can find the Padawans and set the beacon, we'll send an evac shuttle as fast as we can. A group of Jedi from the temple is headed this way, but maybe not fast enough. May the Force be with you. Well, I'll be honest with you a lot. I have done a few things on the back end to make this more fun. Uh, including turn off the what do you call it? The alignment gain uh, notifications. Because I think it's more interesting no, I don't think I have any pets activated. Uh, I'd have to activate the pets. Uh, which I will do at a later time. But yeah, I have uh, decided I was going to turn off the alignment gain because I thought it would be more interesting. I don't want it to be based just off alignment. Uh, I do want to develop this character a bit. Though, and it has been a while since I've actually played a, a pub outside of a smuggler. Because everyone's favorite lady man in body type 4, the fat body type, deserves to get all the chicks, right? Two. Let me see if I'm on the right uh, proficiency. Yeah, I am. No, I'm not. I, I don't like to be on this one. But I'll fix it before I reach level 10. I tend to build my knights and my warriors as a tank over anything else, but I might play with different styles. Uh, I do want to say, as we are stuck here, I do hope you... Uh, leave a like and do subscribe if you are new. Uh, let's see if we can get this series going. Uh, I'll probably throw in some cuts if there's length of distance that I don't feel like uh, <laughs> showing off because nothing happens. But oop. no holocron yet. Need to get this open. Oh, that's right, I have to do that. You're unharmed. Good. Flesh Raider shot me in the leg while I was rescuing some Padawans. Don't know where these things got blasters, but I know how to use them. I've been evacuated to a med center, but the fighting isn't over. I'll push back the enemy, whatever it takes. We need to stop them at the source. Another Padawan found a cave tunnel the Flesh Raiders used to enter this valley. I need you at that tunnel, making sure the Flesh Raiders don't get any more reinforcements through it. I'm not sure what you expect me to do by myself. You won't be alone long. Master Orgus Din is on his way there, too. We need to end this conflict before anyone else gets hurt. Find the tunnel along the mountain range. May the Force be with you. Oh, fun. All right. Uh, on top of that yet. Uh, I gotta find. There's one up there. Oh, I forgot about this quest. It is actually a bit of a pain. Ooh, that one's opened. Hopefully, there's not too many people. There's only 96. Hopefully, they aren't any of my AOE. Two. There's. Is there one down here? No. I'll do the one up here, maybe, if I'm lucky. Let's kill the raider first, and hopefully by then... No, still not it. Now that's a chest. Oh, might as well kill some more boys. Oh. He stopped some boys. That's good. Stats and now jump into this guy. But, anyways, 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 Tython's an interesting place. Uh, I like how it was used in here. It's not really used, I mean, in, in a lot of the later stuff, sadly. Which makes me sad, because it is a fun planet. And I do like how the Jedi just, you know, decide we're better than the natives. 
and decide, like, these guys are brutal. So, uh, we're going back to our ancestor homes and taking out these brutal people. Oh, they're mad at us and attacking us. It's, it's their fault. Boop. 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 Time to eat myself across. Ah, there's one. Ah. Track. I think, yeah, he got it. I'll let him take it. I hate. I hate farming quests early on. It's always not fun. This is this bullshit. Let him go there. I'm gonna go back up here and see if I can snag some. Okay, it's back. I need my AoE stomp. I don't need to use my ability there, but I want to. Because I am an asshole. I think it's been... Ooh. Probably two years since I've done a Jedi Knight story. Oh gosh, it's been a long time. And it is a fun one. It is the stereotypical, I am the greatest hero of all time, or I am a complete douchebag. One of the two. <laughs> Just always a fun little gap you can have. Let him do that one. I'll try to see if I can snipe the ones over here. Oh, I forgot I don't have to do this. This is just a minor thing. Uh, fuck it. I don't need the bonus XP. Fucking... Subscriber. I already get bonus XP. Screw it. How's he looking? He should be resting in the Jedi Temple. But if you're determined to press on, I can help him along. Give him the last of the Kolto if you have to. We'll fight again soon. Hey! Good to see another Padawan alive out here. You're lucky those creatures haven't caught you yet. I've been searching for you. What happened out here? You, you they sent rescuers. We came seeking knowledge of the Jedi Code. The Flesh Raiders interrupted our trial. Never fought like that in my life. We killed it, but Jaredin was badly injured. Huh? I am I actually. I thought you didn't have combat training. The Masters wanted you out of harm's way. We're not warriors. Besides, it is not the Jedi way to seek revenge. That's your opinion, Mineus. It's not what we decided. Training or not, a bunch of animals won't keep us from becoming Jedi. Isn't she right? <laughs> Jedi don't give up, do they? She is wrong. Remember the Jedi Code. There is no passion. There is serenity. God, I remember how enough, stupid that code is. If you want to help us, we could use you. Help make the Flesh Raiders pay. I don't want liabilities. No, go we fucking home. Dangerous path. You and your friends need to get back to camp while you still can. But we're so close to finishing the trial. No, we are not. I see you have a signal beacon. Leave it for us, and as soon as we have gathered our things, we will signal for a ride back. Actually, that was my signal beacon back. Uh, you guys gotta hoof it. Thank you very much. Oh shit! I can still do the side quests. Oh hell yeah! I rem really? I don't remember that. God, it's been so long. It's been far too long since I've been on Tython. I'm usually on the nice red Korriban. So that's where all the cool kids are. I will say I was parting around in uh, Ord Mantel the other day. With a buddy. The big boy squad. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. That way. This is here it is, and we can actually finish up the quest. There we go, we're at... Captured Padawans are done and dusted.
I do think I want to go down while we're running the tank path. Uh, definitely not the fucking vigilance path, god. But I will take suggestions in the comment if you want me to go more DPS. If you do want me to do the stupid damage over time builds. Or the direct damage. Do let me know. Ew. We'll see how this video does. So we are starting this, and this is my second pet project, because I do love this game. I have been playing this game since I was a wee lad. It was a year after the game came out, right after it went free to play. Whenever that was. Oh gosh, it's been so long since I've had this game. Schedule the products in a bit. Yep, that's it. I missed. Yeah, that's the ability I want. Wasted against a single target, but should come back in a second. Stop struggling, Padawan. Your life was over the moment you set foot here. Because the order must evolve, and you are weak. What's this all about? Hmm. You are dangerous. You killed my soldiers. Not attacking, cleansing, and we have only begun. I'll do some cleansing of my own. Don't let this boy play around. There is no surrender. Damn. You do all right? What happened? I just can't. Thank the force that you're both safe. This man's no Jedi. At least not one of us. He organized the attack on the training grounds. Called the Flesh Raiders his soldiers. I warned the council these natives aren't mindless beasts. This is proof. This lightsaber. There's something familiar about it. Strange. You held off all these attackers by yourself with only a practice saber. Impressive. I followed my instincts. That's all. Yep. I served you well. This battle's over, but we don't want any more flesh raiders coming through here. Hello there, bastard. That should hold them back for now. He's a better Jedi Master than the fucking other one. Uh, everything for the consular is just worse, and it makes me sad. Uh... I can see why you're a Jedi Master. When you get as old as me, you learn a few tricks. You never wonder your power quicker to run to. Oh, little Not baby. Yet. I'll get you to a med center. You seem all right to travel alone. Report to the Jedi Council. I only just arrived on Tython. Where am I going? Follow the path leading out of this valley. You'll find the Jedi Temple through the mountain pass. See you there. I will say this. I don't like the Consular story. It's... Not... It's a bad story objectively. Not a bad story objectively. It's a bad story compared to the other ones. Uh, I think it's a lineup of really your supporting cast or companions. 
I think the idea behind the first story is interesting. Do you hurt? I don't want to give away beats. If you do, let me know. Uh, talk about my gripes with it. Uh, but I think what hurts it the most are really how the companions do it. And I think they should implement a mechanic that if you choose to be a goody two-shoes, that there is some side effect, because I don't really feel that there is one. Uh, it is a nice, better focus on diplomacy. Words are your weapon, but it doesn't feel like words are your weapon so much as the forces. Uh, <laughs> If they added a few more, like, oh, diplomatic ends to this, uh, it would be nice. That's why I like the Jedi Knight story. You are, though it is very, I'm the protagonist. I'm the great good guy, or the great asshole. It is a, you know, traditional, down-to-earth Star Wars story. Uh... Sith War, Inside is always fun, just to, always plays the bad guys, even if you play it as a good better guy, you're still a dick <laughs> in a lot of situations. That's part of the reason why I took the alignment off. I want to be more. On its way. You really came through for those Padawans. That's why I took the alignment counter off. I do want to base it more off how I feel like I would respond, or he would respond. Bit of RP. You know, that sort of stuff. Well, students. One of them was injured. You need to send a medic with the rescue team. Standard procedure. They're in good hands. You probably want to get back to your trials. Again, thank you. And may the force be with you. I want to mention this fucker's a master and he's just sitting up here. <laughs> the trainers are fine. The trainers are fine because, fuck it, they're really not there. Look, there's regular Jedi Watchmen down there protecting that and they're just a master sitting up there like, yeah, I'm good. Oop. Leave we go. This way. Okay, this way. Is there actually a path this way? There is a path this way. Alright, we go this way. Ooksy beast. Deceptively aggressive. Why are they friendly then? Probably some Jedi bullshit. Traders. I will say this is an older game, but it doesn't feel bad as a game, which I do like a lot about it. And if you want some good Star Wars stories, I would jump on. I personally play on Starforge, that is the US, I think, well, the US East one. Uh, or just the US one. I don't know how the servers are merged now. Uh, I've been on this one for so long, it's not even funny. Uh, they want me to kill more, so then I shall. There's the one. That's two. That's three and four. There we go. Level 5. Whoop. I'll probably, as soon as I get to the temple, switch over to the defense build until I get word from uh, those who want to watch it what style I should play as. That music, man. The yeah, music and the temple. Look at that beautiful place. We reach hub one, the Jedi Temple. What does he want from us? Yeah, ignore the 36 Hi, messages. I heard you've begun your trials. Master Orgus speaks very highly of you. No doubt you're pleased to have come this far. But some Jedi have the ability to do more, help more people. Interested? Always looking for a way to help. A war is brewing in the greater galaxy. The Sith Empire plots against the Republic, and the Republic looks to the Jedi for aid. 
But not all who train to become Jedi are skilled combatants and leaders. Many are scholars, diplomats, strategists, and scientists. Which is why we've created a simulation to test Jedi and Padawans and certify them to lead Republic troops. You want me to participate in this simulation? That's what I'm asking. The droids here in the yard have been programmed to act according to Imperial military protocols and battlefield tactics. Demonstrate your proficiency at defeating these droids, and you will be on your way to qualifying to lead Republic troops into battle. Can you do it? You can count on me. Excellent. The first set of training droids are ready for you. Get to it. I do want to say, remember, it is the Republic that uh, genocided the homeworld of the Imperials after the first hyperspace war. So everything that the imps do are justified. Hashtag imps did nothing wrong. Just putting that out there. You all know it's true. Down. Boom. And boom. Nice and simple. I'm impressed. Hopefully we'll have something more challenging for you soon. Please do. That was very easy. Oh, right. I forget there's multiple marks of that. Yeah, don't me notice the messages. I'm 3600 mail. I was trying to see if there was a place to do the messages before the video started, and there wasn't. So I haven't been able to clear that out. Holocron call. Interesting. Padawan, I'm Satil Shan, leader of the Jedi Council. I'd like to speak privately with you before we meet with the others. You have my full attention, Master. What do you need? This isn't a discussion for a calm channel. Come to my meditation room in the temple. We'll talk there. That's right, guys and girls. We're going to her special chambers. There we go. It's Teal Shan. Grand Master of the Jedi Order and leader of the Jedi Council. St Satil Shan was born on the core, core world of Brintal for and is descended from legendary Jedi Bastila Shan. Both a gifted warrior and wise teacher, Satil was personally responsible for rediscovering Tython and its hyperspace route. Fun fact, Tython was lost for a very long time. Uh, the old Jedi temple used to be on Coruscant. And there's some fun stuff with uh, what happened in Coruscant. Ever since she has ever since she has devoted herself to the Jedi resettlement of Tython, the revitalization of the order. Satil has played a key role in the recent galactic histories in other ways as well. She fought on the front lines of several major battles, including the Battle of Alderaan and Ren Var, and was present as a Padawan during the Imperial retaking uh, of Korriban, the first modern contact between the Sith Empire and the Republic. She is greatly respected by certain members of the Republic military, and her advice is often sought by the Supreme Chancellor. In person, Satil's strength in the Force is matched with a keen intelligence and a subtle sense of humor. Just imagine, you're some random Padawan, and... S First off, you do meet Master Din, but that's a combat situation. But you get to this temple, and all of a sudden... Yeah, I'm just the leader of the Jedi Order. I've come... I need you to talk personally <laughs> with me. The shit's... <laughs> the shit you must be thinking you've done wrong. <laughs> you have to be fucking terrified. Uh, one more. There it is. Welcome, Padawan. The temple is already buzzing with accounts of your heroism in the training grounds. Master Orgus told me you battled Flesh Raiders, and a Force user armed with a lightsaber. It must have been a disturbing confrontation. Are you alright? Don't worry about that. I admire your composure, but have you truly searched your feelings about this? Taking a life affects the living force, and the one who does the killing. This is why Jedi enter battles calmly, with reason. Emotions like fear and anger lead to the dark side. The man I fought wasn't angry or fearful. 
Not on the surface, perhaps. As the Jedi Code teaches us, there is no emotion, there is peace. Remember those words when times are darkest. Oh. And take this. The Code is a source of strength, but some backup never hurts. I'll see you soon in the Council Chambers. Sounds like someone who's fought before, and... Get another practice blade. Ooh, look at that one. A little fancier than the old one. Looks more... Uh, yeah. It even comes with its own grip. We will reach level 6 in a, <laughs> in a second. Uh, that's a heroic mission. Okay. We don't need to worry about those. Well, let's level up, eh? I searched the temple archives. This force user leading the Flesh Raiders never received Jedi training. Then the Sith have found us. Shouldn't we get ready for them? Calm yourself, Padawan. We can't be certain of anything yet. But we've all sensed a growing darkness. Perhaps it's finally revealed itself. The enemy I faced wanted to destroy the Jedi Order. Can't get much darker than that. Well, that brightened up the room. As Everyone, always. this is the Padawan who saved our people in the training grounds. This is Master Kiwix and her extremely vocal Padawan, Kira. The other masters are transmitting from distant worlds. It's unfortunate our numbers are scattered. Indeed. The temple's safety is unexpectedly threatened. The Flesh Raiders were disorganized primitives before today. I think you've been misinformed. We clearly underestimated the natives. The man leading the Flesh Raiders probably wasn't acting alone. Much of Tython remains unexplored, and we have few resources to spare. I'll handle it, with the help of my new Padawan. Orgus, you haven't taken a Padawan since Coruscant. The Force is strong in him. Stronger than I've seen in decades. Coruscant, I can think of no finer master to complete this Padawan's training. It will be a privilege. Don't get too excited. You're in for some hard work. You'll find supplies in my chambers downstairs. Go equip yourself. I'll meet you there. All right. Look at that guy just standing at the wall. <laughs> I do love that. All righty. Uh, he should be down there. Get those supplies. Ew. Just jump off the edge. those council meetings. I'd die of old age before my colleagues ran out of things to say. Oh, it was just like a minute. <laughs> Have you always felt this way about your fellow masters? Don't misunderstand. They're good people. I just prefer to get things done. This situation has come to you fast. You're braving dangers many Jedi never face. I wouldn't blame you for having questions. This may be the only time to ask them. I get the impression you haven't had a Padawan for years. Why did you ask to train me? As Jedi, you learn to trust your instincts. When I met you in that cave, my instincts told me that I was meant to train you. I don't know why or for what purpose, but the living force brought us together for a reason. Well, you think the Force is alive? That it wants something from us? Want is too strong a word. Let's just say we'll accomplish more together than by ourselves. There's a group of Twi'lek pilgrims on Tython. They've been fighting the Flesh Raiders for months. 
The Republic asked us to deny those Twi'leks aid. They settled here illegally, but frankly, we need them. The Republic shouldn't be telling the Jedi what to do. Forgot how impressionable Padawans can be. Remember, Jedi exist to serve the Republic, even when we disagree. The Twi'leks have a settlement in the mountains. That's your next stop. Establish a base camp and speak to the Matriarch. Find out everything the Twi'leks know about Flesh Raiders. I'm ready to get back out there. Do some good. I'll join you soon. May the Force be with you. Just want to say, <laughs> the Republic literally denied an illegal. S <laughs> Is that so? Does he have? It looks like his chambers are just a formal place. So those are some chairs. How does all that? Interesting. Yeah, the meaning took like a minute. Uh, yeah, I like how there's just an illegal settlement. It's like the Republic goes, yeah, we gotta deny these people aid if they ask for it. They're here illegally. <laughs> God damn, dicks. Always doing the Twi'lek sturdy. I think... We got a little more to do before we end it for tonight. I do want to say, uh, there is a bit about Coruscant I do want to talk about, but that I will save for a little later. Because, well, one, we aren't at Coruscant, two, it might... Mechanized travel is for official business I think they talk only. about it a little bit. Uh, Be safe out there. I think I want to walk. I think I'm going to walk, because I remember there being a quest on the way. I remember for the longest time it was gone. My hope is it is back. Because it is a very fun quest, in my opinion. Is a little bit of fun. Should be up there if I'm not mistaken. If not, uh, oh, I'll cut. They're up than I thought. Okay, so it is up on. I would have to have entered in anyways. Okay, I'm just. I don't remember Tython well enough, man. Now this isn't the one I wanted. Uh. You're too late, Jedi. Like all the other times. The Flesh Raiders already came. They already took their victims. My father knew these mountains. He helped guide the patrols when he could. But when the Flesh Raiders appeared, he never made it home. He wasn't young, but he deserves better than to be ripped apart. Show compassion, Jedi. Find him, and kill any Raiders who'd stop you. I'll do everything I can to find your father. Be well, then. But more important, be quick. Please. If you find him, if he's hurt or confused, you'll know him by his golden promise ring. He wouldn't part with it. Not until death. Oh, that has been a quest that I haven't had in a while. Is this the one I was thinking of? Yes, it is. Okay, this is the one I wanted. More young Jedi in Calicori, I see. I am Yula Fan, Master of Rituals. But it was further I down. Welcome you. You wish to participate in the ceremony, I presume? You understand the dangers? I'm sorry. I don't know what you're talking about. You've not been told, then. I apologize. Many of your brethren, your Padawans, come to Calicori to perform our rite of passage. Those who endure the ceremony are awarded an audience with Kolovish to receive her wisdom and her gifts. Oh. Why would Jedi participate in pilgrim rituals? To prove their strength, to gain rewards, to show friendship. Kolovish lives in the mountains above, once our leader. Now she is our guide and protector. To complete the ceremony, you must walk the thousand steps to her home. You must carry a burning brand and light the signals along the path. You must protect the flame from beasts and flesh raiders. This will prove your worth. If you wish, I will ignite the brand. It burns only a short while. But if you are deserving, it will be enough. Yay. 
I'm ready to carry the flame. Then go, and light each of the signal fires along the mountain path. When you reach the end, you will find Kolovish. All right, I'll light that in a second. I do want to grab the rest of the quests in the area. Now I don't, I'm pretty sure I don't like this one. This one's a bit of a bitch to deal with. Come over here, Jedi, and spare a moment for a humble servant of the Matriarch. I promise, your other dealings will wait. My name is Vidariot Aeon. I minister to the bodies and spirits of the villagers. No, it's not this one. And I have a request. I speak of the Flesh Raiders. Of late, We've seen them growing stronger, and I know why. Oh? You have my complete attention. The Flesh Raiders have been experimenting, concocting an elixir that makes them ravenous. Oh, it is this one. The ones who drink it go mad. Their lips froth, and they pounce like starving animals. It's black medicine, primitive and evil. How could Flesh Raiders learn to do something like that? I have no idea. See if Such me. wickedness is beyond our comprehension. We lack the numbers to attack the Flesh Raiders directly, and not even the Jedi could wipe the monsters from this world. But with our warriors' help, the Jedi could reach the Flesh Raider caves and destroy their vats of elixir. Then count me in. Thank you for this. Odemus Mare knows where the vats are hidden. He is our guard captain. Talk to him to learn the Raiders' secrets. All righty. Ooh, he's playing. He was playing a uh, cis style. Uh, oh, I didn't change it. Fuck. Greetings, matriarch. Master Orgas Din has sent me to help you fight the flesh raiders. So the Jedi finally deigned to recognize my people's suffering. How noble. Nothing to do with the attack on your training grounds, I'm sure. <laughs> we didn't realize how great a threat the flesh raiders had become. And now you seek help from the people you once ignored. My scouts have tracked the Flesh Raiders for months. Watch them grow in strength. I will share what we've discovered. But only if you agree to protect my people. We... We suffer. Mother, you need rest. Let me carry this burden for you. The matriarch appears sick. Does she need a doctor? Thank you, but we have our own healers. This is my daughter, Rana Dalven. She and Scout Chief Morint here will speak for me. I must attend to other matters. Personally, I don't care why you've come. As long as you destroy the Flesh Raiders. Ever since they got their new weapons and gear, they hunt us like animals. The enemy has a camp in the valley nearby. My scouts say the Flesh Raiders store their weapons and other tech in a cave. All right. Nice of them to keep everything in one place. Makes it easier to destroy. Destroying the weapons won't be enough. So I'll just get more. We need to strike fear into the Flesh Raiders. Sabotage their weapons. Fix it so they blow up in their ugly faces. How would we do that? Their technology is standard Republic design. We could overload the power circuits and plasma coils. Here, I'll show you. Sabotage would thin the Flesh Raider numbers and eliminate their technological advantage. If you brought that technology here, we could defend ourselves with those weapons. Either one of those plans could work. My people aren't afraid to fight for their homes. We just lack the means. This debate is pointless unless you can get inside that cave. You'll need one of the leader's access keys. Find the Flesh Raider technology and do what you think is best. Good luck, Master Jedi. Master Jedi, I'm a fucking Padawan. <laughs> Not even a fully fledged Jedi yet. Oh, let's do this little quest. Hard in my way up. Ah, nothing interesting with the chat. I guess I'm, uh, damaged over time. Until I decide to finally remember to change my loadout. Doesn't matter until level 10. Do I still not have any pets? No. Uh, oh, I got conquest points from discovering a location. Uh, 
Okay. Not even looking, I can take him out. Alright, those are the ones I want to finish off. Cub. There. That makes two. And there's three right up there. Alrighty, three. I killed them way too fast. Oh, because these aren't the good ones. Okay. Bam. Done. Donezo. Donezo, 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 donezo. Uh... I think I'll hit those Slave Masters. Oh shit, a quest. Chest. You. Nice. Ah, I'm not gonna do crafting. I don't need that. Alright. Yeah, it should be right over here. Yep, there it is. Go to the next end. Fucking lazing around, huh? Loser. I am good. Alright, almost done here. Oop. Bam. Oh, we're healing. Uh, worse, better, better, worse. All right. Like I would just straight up change clothes. Just straight up like, yep, I'm good. Changing clothes. Yeah, this one and then the next one. I think that's where I'll end it. I do want to beat this guy up. Gold enemy! Named. Ow. Immediately stunned. He's winning. And I won. God, I got heavy armor. Yep. Almost fell off. Yeah, this is... I've actually died before doing this. Uh, <laughs> I've gotten near the top and fallen off. I really need to pay attention at this point. Uh, doo -doo. You perform the rite of the pilgrims well, Jedi. I saw the signal fires as you climbed the path. Very few of your kind make it this far. I am Kalobish. First matriarch and reader of the ancient texts. I led our people to this planet, and I welcome you. You're the reason the pilgrims came to Typhon? My teachings angered our rulers. They spurned our lifestyle and refused to recognize the authority of the matriarchs. On Typhon, we found we could practice our ways in peace.
Even the flesh raiders can't destroy our society. Not forever. Now you've completed the ritual, and you are friend to the pilgrims. You share our burdens, and you share our strength. I'm tremendously honored. Take these gifts. We have very little, as you must know. But you are Jedi. You share our world, and you face a difficult future. What makes you think that? It is the way of Jedi to face darkness. I believe you will face the darkness of our world, and perhaps beyond. Go to your duties now, and as we part, know that my blessings go with you. And we got a headband. That's the real blessing there. Now all our gear slots are filled. That's what's truly important. Beep. Beep. And let's head down. Though I do not feel like uh, dealing with that. So, activate. Do. 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 Alright. Oh, yeah, that's right. This way. Uh, let's go Calicordy Village. Oh, God, I forget that it costs money now. Ah, oh, that's a horrible change they made. All right. Well, we got that one done. Let's talk to these... Beasters. Jedi, I think I know what you've been doing. Vidaria sent you to speak with me. She told you about the Flesh Raider elixir, didn't she? How it makes the Flesh Raiders strong. vidaria has been looking for a way to destroy the elixir, but she's making a terrible mistake. We shouldn't destroy the elixir. We need it. And I'll pay you well if you bring it to me. Yeah, she needs the drugs. I'm not here to bargain with you. Just tell me where the elixir is. But I can pay you credits, Republic credits, more than the Dariot will offer. The elixir can make our guardsmen strong. Yes, it may change them, but it will work. We can defend our village and destroy our foes. Imagine <laughs> if the elixir can make a fuck off. powerful. What would it do for Fuck right player? off. Bring it to me, and you will be rewarded, praised. I won't help you feed the elixir to the pilgrims. Fine. Obey the orders of an old woman and destroy the elixir. But pilgrim blood is on your hands. The elixir is in the caves beyond our village. I doubt Jedi can even come close to the vats. Ooh, damn. What a insult. Oh, no. Underestimated. Yet again. Hollows. And level seven. Ooh, we got new abilities. Blade Storm. Yep. the elixir. Well, they want me to kill the healer. I know it's a war crime, but I don't care. It's fun. Goodbye. 
DM. Doesn't even get a proper name, just father. <laughs> what a true pity. Uh, I do have to go around. Oh, there's another elixir. Let's get a few more. Ow. Fuck off. This one has a fast turnaround time at the very least. This is why I hate this one. Aim for this one, then I'll move on. Yeah, it hasn't turned around yet. Uh, don't want to wait for it. I just want to go. I'll go back to it if I have to. That one's destroyed still too. I get out of the cave, hopefully some more have respawned. Get the healer, and done. Two, one. Stab, stab. Can I hit him? There we go. Oh, it's probably because I'm running with VPN on. <laughs> All right, there is some elixirs in here. Let's see if I can do. Destroyed. Bands and five. Luckily for me, they didn't take those in here. He should have. See, no, he doesn't have the key card. Where is. Alright, it's up here. Uh, I have to actually go into here. Blade style. All right. Seven out of nine. chose to. They deserved it. Such a strong attack. Okay, come on. There we go. And we get our first companion, and I think we shall end it on our return to the village. Okay. Do I sabotage it to kill enemies or take it for the villagers? The villagers probably have some weapons and ways to defend. Let's even the odds. I wish I could see the flesh raiders' faces when this stuff blows up on them.
Tell me the whole story, and more slowly this time. Good thing the flesh raiders don't eat droids. Teach our soldiers how to use these weapons. Train them on the Twi'lek invaders. When will we strike against the Jedi? Patience, Caliph. The Jedi will fall when our army reaches full strength. I never understood the need for restraining bolts anyway. That's because you haven't met assassin droids. Alrighty. Uh, I think I can just fuck right off back to the village. Yeah. Oh, 200 credits. Good thing I'm going to make more than that in a second. Turn in these quests. Oh, let me uh, do this first. There we go. Oh, I'm poor. Jedi, you're back. What happened out there? Where's my father? He's at peace now. I brought you his ring. This is all that's left of him? Those monsters. Tell me you cut them into pieces for what they did. Of course. I killed them all. It was what had to happen. I'm glad some Jedi are willing to take a stand. Some of you understand that not all creatures deserve to live. I wanted my father back. I didn't really believe it would happen. But at least you went out there for a reason. At least you spilled blood. There we go. Yeah. Trust me, I'm a good guy. I promise. I promise. Ah, I am. I am, in the end, going to be a good guy, but I'm not a goody two shoes. You look well, Jedi. I'm glad the flesh raiders. But no drugs. Drugs are bad, kids. Did you destroy the dark elixir. I've done as you wished. You've rid the world of an evil thing. The flesh raiders may brew their dark elixir again, but we won't make it easy. I am grateful for what you've done. Take this gift with my blessing. For now. I leave you in peace. I'm also no snitch. At least right now. Not to these people. They don't get our aid. She died in my arms. You should have seen what those filth did to her. I'm sorry, Selu. We all share your loss. For every one of us the Flesh Raiders butcher, we should kill ten. No, no, a hundred! Will that restore your loved one to life? Don't lecture me, Jedi. My wife is dead. Our people slaughtered. Where were you then? Nothing I say will ever make you feel whole again. But we truly are doing everything we can. What about exterminating those animals? The Flesh Raiders won't stop until we're all dead. Are you going to let that happen? I won't quit until the Flesh Raiders are defeated. That's a promise. We'll see what a Jedi's promise is worth. I hope you can fulfill that pledge. I fear he won't take disappointment well. People wonder why Jedi are forbidden to marry or have families. They don't see how attachments always lead to suffering. Passionate emotions can destroy a person, and Jedi destroyed by passion become something terrible. T7 was captured by the Flesh Raiders. You'll want to see the holo recording he made. While I deal with a droid, talk to Rana. I think our people are ready to help us, thanks to you. One of our scouts watched from a distance while you invaded the Flesh Raider camp. He said you defeated many of them. You risked your life to help us. My people haven't had a champion for some time. Jedi have a duty to protect and defend others. And we promise to share our knowledge in return for that duty. Scouts report that the Flesh Raider forces are gathering in strength. They already control the mountains around us, and now they're invading the ruins of Kaleth. My men spotted them at the remains of an ancient shrine. 
close to your Jedi temple. Aleth was a great city of Force users. Its ruins hold powers we still don't understand. The Flesh Raiders are looking for something there. We can't let them find it. Drive back those Flesh Raiders immediately. I have to take this droid back to the Council. That hooded figure in the holo. I know his voice. The situation is worse than I thought. Do whatever it takes to push the Flesh Raiders out of Kaleth. I'll send you reinforcements as soon as possible. I'll hold the line until reinforcements arrive, Master. If you see that hooded figure from the holo, do not engage him. I get going. Do not engage him. Well, with those final words of wisdom and a new outfit, actually my favorite early game outfit for the Jedi, outside of the headband, which I probably will remove, uh, we are going to end it. So, I hope you enjoyed episode one. Please let me know any comments, uh, comments you have on it, whether good, constructive, dickish, all of them work. Uh, but that is all from me. I will be signing off now.